All right, welcome back, guys. Ape Skull Gamer back with some more Jack and Dexter and the Precursor Legacy. We're still in Spider Cave trying to find everything. There's the last Precursor Orb. It was on the stupid freaking pole. So I found that one. Now we just gotta find the stupid scout fly that apparently I missed. That I have no idea where it is. No. Come on. Let's go. Crap! But I already got it up there, so I don't understand how it can't. It's not up there, so. And it's supposed to be right by these metal crates that were right here. That's what it says. Because I don't see it. Pretty sure we got two in here. So I don't understand where the heck we missed it, but okay. Alright, let's go back, I guess. All right. Let's go back up by those wooden crates, I guess. By the off-beaten path, by the scaffolding of the main room. Oh, thanks for poking me. Thanks. Just love it so much. Maybe it's back here at the beginning. I'm hoping. This stupid freaking Orbs are annoying. Yeah, those are always annoying. There's all that. We got the one by the dark crystal. I know that much. But they're saying there could be one right here. But I already looked like I got this one. And I already got this one right here. Right by this yellow crap. So I have no idea where the heck it even is. Yeah, I don't know where the heck it is. And it's not in the dark room there, because we were just there, so... I don't understand where the heck this thing could be. I have no flicking clue. Because then it says there's one over here by the metal crates and stuff, but we got this one. I grabbed that one. Then there's one in here. Crap. Which I grabbed that one, so what does that leave? Let's see. Right here. Look, once in our get orbs. Okay. So we gotta go back to. Nope, not that page. Yes, I've got the strategy guide. I don't care. I got that one. Scout fly can be a little bit tricky to see. If you point towards the one, you, you may be missing one because you can find path above the entrance. From the main cave. Okay, so we'll check that. By the entrance, by the main cave. That's the only thing I could think of. So what that I could think of is it's gotta be over here somewhere. Not right there. Okay, so let's go over here. And let's nope, that's the main cave. Where the heck? I don't see it. I really don't see this one. Okay, so where the heck is it? It's gotta be that one I missed. I'm missing number one probably. Yes, they're numbered for a reason. Um, 
Okay, let's find where the hell that is. I don't see it. I'm still lost and it's driving me nuts because I'm wasting time here. I'm trying to 100% this game for you guys. Yeah, it's driving me nuts. This butter cave always does this to me. Mm hmm. This always has done this to me. Because it never can be easy to 100% spider cave. Never. It's like the one area that I always mess up and always forget something. Just start shooting randomly. Let's see. Okay. Missing scout fly number one. It be, can be a little bit tricky. Let's see if, if I point you towards the ones that you may be missing. Scout fly one can be found above the cave entrance. In the, okay, so that's that little walkway. We already did that. Scout fly number two is high above main cave on the side that leads to the dark cave crystal entrance. Let's check over there, I guess. Okay, so that was number one technically right there, so then there's supposed to be one above on a ledge way up here by the dark crystal entrance, which is, I'm assuming it's this way here. I'm assuming it's this high one up here. Okay, so let's go up here. Keep going. Okay. Alright. It's by the entrance to the high cave. By the dark cave. Where? I don't see it. I literally do not see it. Yeah, because it's supposed to point towards the whole crap at the bottom there. It's supposed to be right here. So must be I got that one. That is on in the side, main cave on the side that leads to the dark cave entrance, which has got to be the top, yeah. Because then you see all the moving platforms and poop. Oh, wait, no. No, it's up. It's on a brown spot. But that still doesn't make any sense because... Oh, right there. Bingo. I see it now. Yeah, that's a bit confusing. Not a fan of that one right there. That's kind of annoying. Crap. Okay. Now that I found this stupid thing. Oh my god, that was horrible. Okay. Oh my gosh. What the? Oh my god. Found it. I had to look that up in a strategy guide. Well, they stuck it like way out of sight. At least that's done. Sorry about that, guys. Like, I, I hate how Spider Cave's designed. That one little path that, like, sticks out of, like, way out, and it's not even worth a damn. No. So, we'll be able to do the lava tube area, thank God, because I didn't want to waste a video just literally sitting here in Spider Cave for another half an hour. So, sorry about that, guys. Like I said, that's the one area that I always have the most trouble with. Okay, Snowy Mountain I can have some trouble with finding the orbs and stuff, but you can pretty much kind of get that literally the scout fly location is so stupid it's not funny yeah that's a dumb area <sighs> come on let's get to lava tube so we can do that area and get to golemaya citadel now that we've literally 100 percented everything 
up to this point, so then there should be 200 orbs in Golemaya Citadel to give us our grand total of 2,000. So, yep, there's literally going to be, what, almost freaking 500 orbs you don't use. Yeah, ain't that nice. Alright, let's get to Lava Tube. Alright, let's go. Back to floating over the lava. I'd rather do this over the mountain pass. Sorry, but I'd rather. Yeah, mountain pass was kind of annoying. You had a race in time limit. I do hate how they kind of skip the Yellow Sage. How they kind of just make them like stuck in Golemaya Citadel right at the start. Like that's where their Citadel is, is right in Golem. Like it's right on top of freaking the Yellow Sage's thing, which is kind of dumb as far as I was concerned. I think that's really kind of stupid. Yeah, I don't like the way that's designed. Um, we're literally just going to go collect everything first and then we're going to get to the end of this because guess what? That's what we do here. Like I said, I'd rather deal with the lava tube section here than having to go sit there and do mountain pass again. Because mountain pass sucked. Yeah, mountain pass was just pretty bad. Okay. Kaboom. Alright, that was fun. I blew up already. It's like one of the few times you're going to blow up. Because you're going to blow up a couple times here trying to collect everything. Yeah, you're going to do it a couple times. Trust me. You will. Woohoo! Because of the way they position everything, it's like up, down, left, right. It's like holy poop. It's like almost putting like a cheat code in. Yeah, it feels like it sometimes. Trust me. Because of those sides here, right here, you have to go on the sides right here. So. Oh poop! There's a scout fly. There's scout fly number two. Okay. No, dang it! I missed the cooling balloon. That's what killed me that time. Like I said, the lava tube is going to be a little bit of a pain in the butt, but I'd rather deal with it than over Spider Cave and Snowy Mountain and Mountain Pass. Those are the sections I really don't like in this game. Not gonna lie, they're more annoying than they are anything else. Spider Cave wasn't bad. It's not a word. It's not a bad level. I don't hate that level because it's you know, it's. I mean, I don't like spiders in the first place, but I don't hate that level. I just really get annoyed with trying to collect things because of how that level's designed. Yeah, that level's got bad level design for trying to collect everything. Oh yeah, that level is terrible for that. Because I always find more issues than anything else to... Shoot the power spheres to open the door. I'm working on it, but I gotta get cooling stuff to... Where's the door? Oh, there's the door. But I need cooling spheres. Because I'm melting again. Yeah, I'm melting yet again. Go figure. Alright. So now that we've done that, now I can go like this. I've got all the orbs, so that's not the issue now. I have to get the scout flies. Like I said, the scout flies are kind of annoying in this area, but they're not the impossible thing to collect. No, they're not, like, really impossible. Like, they really pretty much made this pretty much basic. Trying to find out where all the scout flies are, though, is a pain in the butt, but that's something you're going to have to willingly deal with. And at least you only start right here. At least they made it so you got like a checkpoint system. Yeah. But I don't see any scout flies here, so let's go over here. Let's go back into this tube. Yeah, isn't it fun? Like I said, I don't know which I'd rather deal with mountain pa like 
There's times I'd rather. Dang it. Pickle beats buttholes fart McDo. Woohoo. Like I said, I guess I'd rather deal with lava too, but it's just the way it's leveled, designed is kind of annoying. Like with the whole like ramps and jumping and stuff. Yeah, some of these ramps are kind of annoying, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie, some of these ramps are designed like poop. So, I gotta find where these scout flies are. That's the biggest pain in the butt. Is the scout flies. Yes, it's where those stupid scout flies are located is the most annoying part about this. Okay, there's our scout fly. There's another scout fly. I don't even know where the heck it came from, but okay, I'll take it. I will take any scout fly I can get. Ooh, barely made that jump. Holy poop. There's the sixth scout fly. Where's the seventh one? Seventh scout fly, where are you? Come on. Go. Come on. Go. Where's the scout fly? Oh, don't tell me I missed it. Are you serious? I missed it. Where'd I miss it? Stupid thing. Ah. Uh. Get back on the ride, Jack. Yep, get back on it, because we're going to go fucking find this. Yep, we are. We're going to go back and find this. I don't know where the heck I missed it, but I did. No clue. I'm hoping it's like right near the end here. Oh, thank God it's right here. Yes! Thank God. It's just hard. Alright, so we got that. That's two orbs, right? We got the 50 precursor orbs. Yep, okay. So now we can let Kira over and Samos. So let's let them over into the Yellow Sage's lab. Well, call him my Citadel practically anymore, but... Okay. Boom. Let's let them in. Hey! Where's old Short Drain and Wrinkly? This is terrible. Father is missing. I think Gall and Maya may have kidnapped him as well. Relax, sweetheart. I got everything under control. Under control? Lurker armies continue to grow across the land. The sages have been kidnapped. Gall and Maya have gathered enough eco to complete their terrible plan. And to stop them, you're going to have to fight your way through their citadel. Uh, yeah. That about, uh, sums it up. You've got to rescue my father before it's too late. And Jack, be careful. Yeah, we will be. I like that hint that they kind of have like a, a thing going on back then, even in this. So next time, guys, we're going to go into Golem Maya Citadel at, and do all that. But until then, guys, this is Ape Skull Gamer signing off. And as always, just do the most importantly of all and keep gaming. Take care, guys.